So now for the fun part. Better than anything that I can tell you about the Girls Inc. experience is the opportunity to hear it directly from the girls themselves. So let me introduce to you today a remarkable young woman, a brand ambassador, national brand ambassador, and a New York City participant, Aubrey. Hi, I'm Aubrey, a proud first-generation Haitian-American high school senior, hailing from Brooklyn, New York. I joined Girls Inc. of New York City about three years ago and was selected to be a National Girls Inc. brand ambassador earlier this year. As a brand ambassador, I get to re represent the voice of my peers and be part of meaningful discussions related to issues unique to our experiences as girls today. I take this responsibility very seriously and love having the opportunity to listen and learn from my Girls Inc. sisters. School is very important to me and I'm passionate about social justice issues, especially women's rights, bodily autonomy, menstrual equity, and diversity. So I went on the hunt for the perfect school that met my interests and found one that had Girls Inc. programming and embedded within its curriculum. This was a huge selling point for me. The Girls Inc. programs were thought provoking and the diversity in its participants was exactly what I was looking for. For example, in lieu of the typical high school health class, I was exposed to Girls Inc.'s healthy sexuality programming where we discussed topics like healthy relationships and consent. Because sexuality is such a taboo topic, I appreciated having a place where I could learn about my body in a safe space with no judgment or embarrassment. The Girls Inc. Healthy Sexuality course was comfortable, educational, and useful. I learned so much and was even emboldened to teach others. Did you know that all girls who aren't taught healthy sexuality are more likely to get pregnant and lack economic prospects? Speaking of the economy, I was also able to participate in Girls Inc.'s financial literacy program. Here, I learned everything from budgeting to saving to how to use a credit card and how to survive on a college student bud budget. I'm gonna need that. If you know, you know. <laughs> Currently, I'm part of Girls Inc.'s college shower program that is preparing us for all facets of college um, planning and beyond. Girls Inc. really has a way of covering all the bases that set up girls for success. In fact, coming out of this program, I have been able to receive my commitment and will be, accepting, uh, will be attending Wesleyan University in the fall. <laughs> Aside from all the wonderful programming, Girls Inc. has provided a space that makes me feel seen and safe. Here I can decompress from the rigors of the academic day and talk freely to my peers and mentors about anything. I was able to share with my mentor challenges I was facing when a conversation in my history class got heated. A classmate who took issue with my contribution to the to discussion suggested that I should go back to my country. My mentors gave me the courage to bring up the subject with my school's administration, and they advocated on my behalf to hold the school accountable. This led the school engaging the student and I in a candid conversation around diversity, respect, and inclusion. Our, as a result, the safety that I felt within Girls Inc. now extended to my greater school community, where I now feel accepted and a sense of belonging. That experience pushed me out of my comfort zone in the best way possible, and Girls Inc. continues to motivate me. Stemming from my social justice passion, I'd like to pursue a career in journalism. Recently, I got a taste of what it feels like to be a reporter via a partnership between Girls Inc. and Mean Girls Movie. This was a once in a lifetime opportunity where I got to represent the Girls Inc. on the pink carpet as their official news correspondent where I interviewed the cast and crew of the film. It was the most nerve wracking <laughs> but meaningful experience of my life. <laughs> I was so overwhelmed that I could almost feel my aspirations to become a journalist slipping away from me until I reminded myself of those three words, strong, smart, and bold and I knew I needed to be all three at that moment. I am eternally grateful for Girls Inc. for giving me the platform to shine and exercise my true boldness. It was a push that I needed to reap the benefits of the opportunity to the fullest. <laughs> 